Hey everybody, I'm really excited today. I've been saving up my gold tickets here. I've got 51 of them and we just got this new crate showing up here, this Ice Queen crate. Um, there's two reasons I'm excited about this crate. One, there is an Epic XPR 50. I do not have an Epic XPR 50, so I'm hoping that would be one of the guns that I get. The other thing that I'm excited about here is the ASM-10 Space Station. Look at that iron sight. That's like a holographic iron sight. Also, it just looks super, super cool. So I've decided that with a guaranteed epic at 10 draws and 30 draws, I've got 50 tickets here. So I'm gonna play till 30 draws, I think. So let's see what we get. Also, if we get the ice queen, that would be cool too. I'm just gonna do 10. We got the XPR! Look at that! Wow. Okay, definitely doing a video on that because I've never done a video on the XPR. So, that is going to be today's video. So, I know I said maybe we'd do 30 pulls, but the XPR 50 shiver is really what I was hoping for. Um, so that's my first epic camo on an XPR 50. Um, you can see this is the only one here. Um, but yeah, so we're going to stop at 10. This is the gunsmith that we're using today. I went with maximum ADS time, uh, four times scope, and then the 18 round reload. Um, and let me show you why. I know there is, of course, the stopping power reload. That would be the other ammo that's interesting here. But let's look at the damage. So this is the regular ammo. Um, it's only a one shot kill out to 100 or up to the head. Um, everywhere it's a two-shot kill otherwise. Stopping power, you can get a one-shot kill to um, everything from the you know chest, arms, head. Um, however, the fire rate decreases a bunch. So on the top there, we got a 250 millisecond fire interval, and at the bottom it's 375, so it's much slower. Um, so I decided to go with the 4 times scope and then the 18 round reload so I can play it more aggressive. Sort of like the SKS, but not quite as good. Um, I'm not really sure what to do with this XPR because it's not as fast as the SKS, which is a great weapon, by the way. Um, but at the same time, if you put on the stopping power, I think maybe you might as well use one of the snipers that's got the bigger one-shot kill range, like the DLQ or the Locust or the Koshka. Um, but this is what we got here today, and let's take a look at this. Um, not a super impressive epic camo, but it's a little bit animated there. Um, kind of looks just like ice and frost, I guess. That's what the shiver is. Let's go inspect it. Okay, quick weapon inspect here this way. So yeah, just some frosty, shiny, icy stuff. Um, and then this is an example of the fire rate here. This kind of sounds like a little plink, plinky gun. I guess that's sort of what it is if it doesn't do as much damage. Um, but yeah, that's what we're doing. So let's go try it out. Okay, let's see what kind of sniping we get here. Really, I, like I said, I've never done a video on this because I've never gotten an epic camo for it, but I really don't know what to expect here. So we're going to try some sniping posts here. Hello. Could not get the double shot there. I think there's too much... Vertical recoil. The vertical recoil is not the best. Maybe I should have put an attachment on there to help with that, but it's too late now. We're already playing. So let's get that guy. Okay. Probably hit him in the legs, but it doesn't matter. It's the same damage as the upper body. Yeah, we're one and one here. Oh, hello. Yeah, I don't know that this is going to work to be aggressive by any means. I'm not an expert sniper either, but I think the four times scope will help. I'm not like I'm playing some longer angles, but not like cross map stuff. So I don't need the full six times scope. Oh, hello. Look at that. Playing aggressive, <laughs> but not on purpose. Everybody. I kind of want to stay back here because I don't want to run into the close quarter buildings, but I see somebody shots here. I suppose that was a little bit aggressive too. 
That's working out okay. UAV online. Hunter killer drone deployed. Alright, we're gonna switch to the pistol to run closer. I might actually use this pistol a few times if I need it. Okay! Look at that. ADS time, 4x scope helps with the closer aiming for sure. But I can't actually do any real sniping because there's too, <laughs> too much recoil and I can't get them in one shot. So who knows, maybe the stopping power ammo would have been better. Okay, somebody might be coming in this way. Shoot on the UAV. Oh, one to the right. There's one here. Oh, I don't know why that didn't fire right away, but we got him. He had no idea I was there. Okay, somebody just died behind me. I hear some footsteps. Getting nervous because I don't want to aggressive snipe people, but yeah, hip firing that was my last resort there. Shock RC would have been better, but I wouldn't have been able to pull it out in time. Oh, there's a guy there, so let's let him discover me since I wasn't going to get there quick enough. Oh, I should have had that one though. Oh, hello. Hey, I don't, you know, even if I did hip fire him, I still have to hit a second shot, so I wouldn't have gotten that kill. I obviously did not expect anybody to be there. Now we gotta take out a dog. That should be pretty easy, but even, yeah, the vertical bounce is so high. So I don't know what to do. If I add some vertical recoil attachments, that'll slow down the ADS time, and then again, do I just go use the locus or something? I think that makes more sense if I did that. So I'm trying to keep this an agile build. Oh, what? There was a bunch of people over there. It's too close. Fight harder. Oh, there's a guy. Oh, there he is. Okay. That's the kind of kill I want to get. Where I'm being stealthy and I have no idea where I am. Okay, hunter killers come in. Too late to throw the trophy system. I hear more footsteps. I don't think that's the guy I heard, but we can get the kill there. I think he had a death machine too, so that's nice. That we got that out of the way. Hear more people again. Oh. Yeah. I should should have pulled out the pistol. Oh, apparently he knew I was there though. Maybe. But we're still up by two here. Check the sniping spot. Though this seems like too far. Most like just with the recoil, I think I unintentionally limited the accuracy at it's up to range. You enemy UAV spotted. It's so hard to get two Tied shots at people from that far away. Enemy, come on. Oh, huh. After I readjusted it's that one, I was aiming at my order. teammate's head. That's why I didn't get any hits. Now we're only up by one. Tied for the lead. So I'll it's just close. go Fight up harder. here because this is a pretty safe spot. We're tied now. Is that guy coming back? Okay, got a kill. Just need one more for the team. And we got it! So, there's a victory. Narrow victory. Tied for third. Okay. You're tied for second, I guess. Ten and eight. Alright. I'll take it. But... More importantly, I will certainly accept this free XPR 50 shiver to re-download it, apparently. Because, um, yeah, I don't. my goal is to collect one epic camo for every weapon, and we're getting closer here with this t video today. So, thanks for watching, everybody. Let me know if you get anything fun from that crate.